You're looking for events and things to do in the month of December in LA and I have six suggestions for the places to go and get involved in whether you live in LA or just out here visiting. I want to show you. Create new memories this holiday season with your friends and family at Universal Studios Hollywood. The park is full of holiday decorations and holiday delights. You can celebrate Christmas in the Wizarding World of Harry Potter where Hogsmeade has been transformed with festive decor and nightly snowfall, lights, and music at the Hogwarts Castle until January 6th. Plus, you can join in on the Hootacular festivities with the Grinch from the 14th to the 30th and enjoy that holiday menu at Three Broomsticks with some seasonal food and beverages including that hot butter beer, which I'm looking forward to. Experience multiple winter themed powder pack synthetic tubing lanes built directly into the giant hills of the old lounge at Montecito de Leo Poletti Park, which is only five minutes from downtown LA. Hop on the tube and fly through the twinkling light archways. There's gonna be food trucks and snacks, and of course, some hot drinks. Tickets start at only $12, and for the first time ever, an interactive light show that you control with musical instruments. And if you fancy yourself to be a little bit extra, then definitely go for that Penguin VIP Pass. I did. All the tubing you could want to do plus all other activities are unlimited. This pass also gets you into the fast pass lanes and access to the beer and wine cash bar. And of course, you get to choose either the Penguin Snuggie or the Norwalk. I went for the Penguin of course, but kinda wish I had gone for the Norwalk. I'm so confused. I want to show you Grab a buddy or a lover or three and head down to LA Live for some holiday ice skating. No advanced registrations or online sales are available for general admission tickets. They're sold only on site at the rink. Individual general admission, 20 bucks. Kids age six and under or 62 and over are only 15 bucks. And if you're an LA Kings season ticket member, also only 15 bucks. And if you want to skip the on-site line, you may purchase Fast Pass online for 40 bucks per person. LA Life has about 20 restaurants surrounding the rink and select restaurants are gonna be offering special deals when you show up with your ice skating ticket stub. So make sure to keep it with you, don't lose it. Make sure to check that LA Live event calendar to see what other events might be happening at either the Staples Center or the Microsoft Theater. You don't wanna get stuck on a day where it's gonna be really busy. There are also going to be a silent skate party which is an ice party where you will be provided headphones from Silent Storm to dance and skate in silence. Event sells out, so buy your tickets soon. I'm talking buy them right now. You know I got you covered. The links are down below. I've done this before, and trust me, it is so worth it. It's really fun. And you can get your groove onto your own beat by choosing your own skating soundtrack or select a station spun live by DJ Howley. And if that wasn't enough, you can also channel your inner Winter Olympian and learn to curl at the Beginner's Curling Pop-Up hosted by the Halloween Curling Club. Don't be naughty. Make sure to check the website hours because they do change. I want to show you. If you don't want to go to the ice skating rink because it hurts your tailbone too much, don't worry, I got you. There's the LA Zoo Lights, which is an immersive lighting experience featuring a disco ball forest, a twinkling tunnel filled with dynamic swirls of color, and whimsical animated animals. Going on now to January 6th, it's going to be closed on December 24th and the 25th. They do have VIP experiences and there's going to be a slumber put on by Wild Wonder Family at the LA Zoo Lights Overnight Adventure. It's going to be 85 bucks, which includes a guided tour of LA Zoo Lights and you get a dinner, a snack, continental breakfast, indoor overnight camping, and a beastly bedtime story. Ooh, and some morning animal encounters. That should be pretty cool. Check the site for the dates. I want to show you. Head out to Pershing Square in the heart of beautiful downtown LA for more holiday ice skating because there's never enough of that really. You'll be surrounded by the art and of course the ever impressive city skyline. You're going to get to enjoy entertainment and of course be under some beautiful stars. All six of them. Four of them? All of them. There's going to be of course the ever popular silent skate party on Wednesday December 19th from 7 to 8 and 8.30 to 9.30. Headphones are going to be provided to all you skaters and you will have the ability to choose one of three stations to skate to. That's nice. It's open daily starting now until January 21st. You're not gonna wanna miss this one. So go ahead, grab your family, your friends, a coworker, or a sexy date, and make some of those unforgettable memories.
Hours and times vary by day and there will be skating sessions that last 60 minutes. Online ticket sales are limited, but same day tickets are available at the ice skate rink ticket window 15 minutes before the first session. Tickets sell fast, so make sure to arrive early or purchase your tickets online for a future date. And a portion of the ticket proceeds benefit the City of Los Angeles Department of Recreation and Parks, so that's nice. On the ground parking will be available on a first come first serve basis at the Persian Square parking garage, but you're best off taking the Metro. Take the Metro Red Line or the Metro Purple Line to the Persian Square station. And finally, the Los Angeles Arboretum and Botanical Garden invites you to the Moonlight Forest. Experience art, culture, and some beautifully crafted lanterns. Some depict beautiful animals, other shimmering exotic flowers, and figures from Chinese legends. Live performances at certain times. Of course, it's gonna be food trucks and bars. These lanterns are gonna be reflecting three themes, one being nature, the other children's gardens, and finally, Chinese culture, all of which embrace the mission and communities of the Arboretum and celebrate the time-honored tradition of lantern art. Tickets will be dated and timed, but there will be free parking during the festival and available on the Arboretum lots. Check the site for entry times, and if you're an Arboretum member, then you're eligible for 15% discount. Wednesday through Thursday, adults are 25, children 3 to 17 are 20, Friday through Sunday, adults are 28, and kids are 23. Well, that's it, guys. Those are your six seemingly awesome events to do in this month of December. If you're able to go to some of them and take those beautiful pictures, DM me, tag me in the photo. I want to see them and hear what you did. If you like this video, share it. Subscribe for more videos like this, and we'll see you next week.